Uh, dear sir, Mr. Shug of God, I am a Gox guy. Uh, thank you for sending me your video a few weeks ago. My apologies for not having answered earlier. The simple reason why I didn't react as fast as you maybe expect is simply because I haven't had the right material or hardware to do it in an acceptable way. I really appreciate that at least we share the same taste of our means of locomotion. Yes, myself, three years ago, rode the same type of motorcycle as you do today. Uh, congratulations for your technical understanding. Uh, today, due to my advanced age, I choose a more comfortable ride. Uh, uh, I, I, I come on right away with my answer to your question. Uh, atheism is accurate and correct because education leads to it. Uh, well, I know you're living in a country where homeschooling is allowed and where it's allowed that Nazi parents educate their children to be Nazis, where stupid parents educate their children to be stupid adults uh, and transmit any delusion to the next generation. <laughs> I absolutely appreciate your fury and, and, and your, your, your dependence to your hobby. To this contradictive very old book. It's, it's really nice to have found a goal in your life. I told the same thing to one of my best friends who as you are a passionate fighter for his cause. I think he's worldwide the biggest collector of Barbie dolls, and he knows everything about his hobby. It's impossible to argue with him that they are all the producers of nice dolls on the market. He always defends Mattel and Barbie. But maybe my friend's hobby is less or likely less offensive than yours. Dear Sir, Mr. Shock of God, let me explain my thought. Uh, if ever you want to be a good person and accept the whole humanity with all the differences, how they are, your book wouldn't allow you to do this. Unfortunately, you believe and your book don't allow you to be part of the human community. It don't allow you to go hand in hand with all humankind to fight together for a better future. It excludes certain groups of humans, like you and me, the right to live in freedom and peace. Yeah. So, dear sir, this was my answer to the video you sent me by personal message. Uh, please, dear sir, Mr. Shog of God, understand that I don't want to communicate further uh, uh, on with you in the future, and let me give you two reasons why. First, you're living in a country who represents 5% of the world's population, and the people sharing the same belief as you are about or maybe less than 30% of the population of your country. So, it is such a little minority of the people on earth with whom I really don't want to lose my time. Uh, my second reason is it's a proven fact that the world's population gains every 10 years 1% of growth uh, on the IQ, uh, which means that we have simply to wait until your fellows have disappeared. I wish you a very nice day. Sir, Mr. Shug of God.